Welcome back to Ozark's Fox AM. It's time for another Intrigue Journal with Sean Paul. All right. Hey, how are you guys? We're good. Good. Very good. good. All right. So, you know, sometimes I come on and you say, oh, my, I'm freaked out already, right? Yeah, yeah. Let's talk about fears. Okay. We've oh. all got them, right? And sometimes people can just be locked up paralyzed with their fears. We're talking about mm. phobias today. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. And I've uh, done some research on seven of the most uh, common fears in America. Oh, all right? okay. Now, yeah, the right. first one, Jeremy Rabe, I'm almost positive you do not have. Okay, what is that? That would be glossophobia. Glossophobia. Oh. I'm guessing it has to do with the microphone. Public speaking. I do not have a fear. And Kelly? Oh, my goodness. Not a problem. Uh, no, now it's not, but before, I, mm -mm, I okay. didn't want a public speaker. All right, but you are both fine public speakers. I now, so, guess right? I actually enjoy it. And it I, we couldn't tell. We had no idea. Really? I like it. Newsflash, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. My life would be easier if I loved it. Right. No, but you're very good at it. Well, thank you. Both you are. You okay. both are. All right. That's a good one. All right. Acrophobia. What do you think that oh, wait, is? Oh, I know that one. Oh. Heights? Yes. Oh. Heights? Yep. Got yep. that one. You got that yep. one? I'll tell you what. Now, if I'm on top of a building looking down, I don't like that, but I'll get on my roof to put up Christmas lights, no problem. So I don't know. What I think is. there's a little bit of height difference yes. between those two well, scenarios. So. Maybe so, but you're also busy doing something, That's and true. you're focused on well, that. But have yeah. you seen the guys that are working on the buildings when they're not I finished and they're on nope. a beam with their feet no, hanging that, down and oh, they're eating couldn't, lunch? Yeah. Couldn't, yeah, couldn't do it. Yeah, I, I'm I'm very uneasy with that. Okay, uh, claustrophobia. Yes. 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 Can we, yes. The, like, have you gone spelunking in caves and? Won't you know, do it. I've no. been in situations like that. I don't like it. No, I hate it. But yet somehow, like somehow I still pursue it. Hmm. And, and really what it is is you, if you want to get over a phobia, you have to consciously want to overcome it. There's some ways you can do things with hypnosis. Okay. Get yourself down to a real relaxed state. Well, anyway. We I don't, don't want to do it anyway. You don't want to do it anyway. Either. Okay. No. Um, dentophobia. You two, neither one of you have this one. I'm guessing is dentophobia the... Let's take I'm a look. It's... Subjecting yourself to that. You have to go to the dentist. Yes. Okay. Because I, I don't mind it, Kelly. Do you? I don't mind it. You know, because uh, going to the dentist, even if you hate it, is far better than suffering. Right. You know, not yes. going to the dentist. Right. So, and and that's one way of overcoming these phobias. All right. Okay. Um, here's my big one. Oh, ophidiophobia. Ophidiophobia. What, what would that be? Ophidiophobia. I don't know. What is it, Sean? In fact, my wife doesn't have it nearly as much as I do. Let's show them what ophidiophobia is. Ophidiophobia. Ah! Yeah. Yeah. Right. I have that. Ophidiophobia. Uh, I have Mr. that. Mr. Rabe? That doesn't, I don't want to look at the screen. No, right. That bad. Right. No. And it looks right. so real. I, I, I've actually gotten better, though. We, we took a snake out of our garage. That was a big thing. I had to get over that. Oh, my gosh. Yes. I don't enjoy the snakes. I okay. want them to live in God's, in God's nature area, but away, away from, from me. Us. Okay, yes. but that's one of God's creatures. Yes. And so is this, arachnophobia. Oh, of don't course. Like spiders. spiders. Right. No, thank you. Okay, so my wife, she does have that. Me, not so much. i am always been brought in to kill a spider. Uh-huh. I, I always have Dave come kill a spider. Right. Yeah. I don't. You like, don't take I care mean, of it? Again, I had a spider that lived in my bathroom for years because I didn't want to move him because I was like, well, he's happy there. He's not bothering me. Oh, he would bother me. Yeah, <laughs> I just let him stay there. All right, well, what about another one? Chalrophobia. What is that? Uh, chalrophobia? Chalrophobia. Chal chalrophobia. Yes. Like what is it, Sean? Let's show him. Chalrophobia. <laughs> it's a real condition. Why did you? I asked him, why did you do this? It's a real condition, everybody. All right. Can we come in? Because I have this. This is terrible. Why okay. were they playing this? All right, all right. What, what causes this? Because I'm not afraid. Why is he no, afraid? No, no, I don't know. Well, we could go into that, but we should just overcome it with a little okay. experiment. Okay. Jeremy, okay. All right? Can they so, move the clown? Yeah, maybe we can go back to the cover slide because there yeah, we there go. you go. That's much better. What the what? Okay. Oh, listen. All right. This just kind of ruined his day. He's got to get back in the rhythm of. Okay, little okay. little experiment. Okay, yeah. All right. Okay. I've got pictures of clowns oh, here. All right. Goodness gracious. You see these okay. pictures of clowns. And what I need you to do is I want you to just sort through them. If you get a, an okay feeling about the image, I want you to set it here. If you get a, a slightly concerned feeling, I want you to put it okay. there. But the idea is you move with speed so you allow your intuition to work. You so want, don't okay. think about it. Don't just think of well, feeling. A feeling. And once you set it down, don't change your mind. Okay. All right? Interesting. And we'll, we'll okay. start slow and okay. then you can okay. go so. from there. All right? Mmm. Mmm. He's actually being a very good sport about this, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, he is. Yes. <laughs> oh, that's not so bad. 
Yeah. This is actually going better than I thought I because like you saw it. how he recoiled yeah. with the picture yes. of the, the clown. Okay. Oh, there we go. Wow. wow. That was that, that was, was extremely well done. So, uh -huh. Jeremy, let me just let's just I was watching this. Okay. I, I happen to know what the backstory is on a couple of these pictures okay. and what their background is. So, for instance, on this one right here, what was uh, what was it that made you put it in the in the pile that made you feel like it's okay? I think it was the the coloring. Mm -hmm. And he kind of seems non-threatening. Um, yeah. Okay, all right, great. So then you had all of these, and I watched you go through it. And, and there's one that always I kind of always kind of triggers me. This one right here. Yeah, that's terrible. That yeah. okay. And what was it that you didn't like about well, him? Well, he's violent. Oh yeah, because he's holding a handgun, right? And a bomb. Right. Well, what what I find interesting about it, Jeremy, is this one that you found was okay and non-threatening was actually uh, composed by Lenny Jones, nine years old. He's a child. Oh! Oh, In nice. fact, every one of these pictures that you got an okay feeling about, they were all <gasps> drawn by children. How in the world? This is actually from the, uh, the Department of Justice, and they were doing a profile for psychology. Wow. All right. What? Now, this one that you didn't get a good feeling about with the gun, Benson Wilkinson, 24 years old. Serving a life sentence in jail. Oh look at that. my gosh. Here, I'm going to hold this up. Look at this. So there's. Look, okay, now look. this one you didn't get a good uh, feeling about. Do you see who this one was uh, composed by? Look at that. Who is it? John Wayne, Wayne Gacy. He's a killer too. Yes. This. Let me show you something else. This one right here. You didn't get a good feeling about this one. Charles Manson. Ah, in fact, in fact, every single one you didn't get a wow. good. Show. Jeremy, look at this. You're How did I do that? They're all. Composed by so this is what I want yes, you to think about. Interesting. You have this blanket fear of clowns, but you also wrong. have a gut intuition that can keep you safe or keep you away from danger or know what a, a trusted situation is. And you should listen to that intuition and not just assume blanket right. fear for all clowns. Oh my now God. what I want to know is that picture that came up before. If now that you know this, would you be as afraid? Maybe not. And now I'm learning, Jean Paul. Thank you because I want to trust my gut right. and I have a good instinct. Right. Jean Paul, you're awesome. Well, this is so but, much fun. What, what would have happened though if I would have got one of them wrong? Well, then you might need to see some couch time. <laughs> therapy. I need <laughs> therapy. therapy. Sean Paul, thank you so much for My coming. pleasure. It's so good to see you. Thank I feel you. much better about myself now. I feel better I about myself. I feel better. This. Let's explore yeah. this some more. I think we should. Oh, okay. Jack's Fox Sam. We'll be right back. Ah, there's the clown again, though. It's startling, Sean Paul. Look it's at him. startling. He's not oh, scary. my gosh.